Paddy, Massachusetts. We're in the Hokanam neighborhood, which is the southernmost part of Hadley, and we're pointing towards a one-room schoolhouse in the distance. And that schoolhouse was to serve all the children that were in this neighborhood many, many years ago. Back when there was a lie, the, the kids couldn't have to walk more than two miles in one direction to a school. And so you need schoolhouses all over the place because there were no buses yet, of course. And you can see it's a very beautiful neighborhood based upon agriculture and a lot of the land has conservation restrictions on them so it's very hard to build houses around this area. Now what we're going to do is point out the features as we go around and we'll come back. Alright, the highway you're looking at is Route 47. It travels from South Hadley all the way to the northern part of Massachusetts. It's a great agricultural route. In fact, it's called a designated scenic highway of Massachusetts. And we're going to point over here. We see farms. The farms are based upon mostly corn in this area. But Hadley also has a lot of tobacco farms and other crops. So you get a lot of things out of these farms. Yeah. Now, there's a big tree in the way, but behind there is Holyoke. And that's Mount Nanatuck. In between is... The Connecticut River. Now you can't see that, but the whole neighborhood is defined by the Connecticut River, by the Mount Hood Range, and and it's very beautiful and helped it keep it that way. Now we'll go up and look at some of these buildings. We got all, all very old houses up here, but most importantly, we're going to see up here <coughs> agricultural equipment galore. Because of what you're looking at is a dairy farm it's called the Longview Farm or the Barstow Farm, and you got a slurry store. They make slur a slurry of the food for the cows, and <coughs> they. Behind that is the big barn and the big milking stations, and some of those are anaerobic uh, mixers. I think they're the green ones up beyond us. But if you look up in the hills, you see the start of the Mount Hood Mountain in the Mount Hood Range, and you can see there's a lot of cliffs on this side. The range is that way, no matter where you are, whether you start in Beltstown, Hadley, Granby, South Hadley, the northern <clears throat> the western and northwestern slopes are always cliffs and if you go in east hampton you can see those cliffs and if you go through westfield southwick agwam and into connecticut they stay cliff it's one whole range that looks the same with the same pitch on both sides all right now you you can see the top there but up there is a trail and that's the menendek trail and the new england trail so we we'll walk up some more <coughs> Okay, so we can see more of the farms up here, and you can also see the Barstow house to the side is the greenhouse. They lived there for five generations, that's a lot, it's about 150 years, and they plan on staying here and keeping the whole farm going, plus what they do with it, they made it also into a restaurant, and we're going to go one more place and see that restaurant, but you can see it's quite gorgeous and it's beautiful they put around here. Now, things you cannot see around here, there's a road going up the mountain along the side of the mountain. There's a road going up to the t house on the top called the Summit House. You can't see it from here, but we're at the very tip. And there's a road coming down it's from the far north. And also at this position towards the south, you can see more of the farm there. But if you go enough on this road, you meet the Hokanum uh, Cemetery, which is a small cemetery on uh, Route 47. So, there's a lot. Now, there's one more place.
Okay, we're going all the way back to where we were, and you see they made a restaurant. You have an outdoor portion, indoor portion, and they keep it open year round. You can have all kinds of beautiful uh, food here, menu, takeout, so forth, including corn in the cob and lots of specialties. Now, what we do is we'll sweep the mountain range, and I won't be talking, but you'll get to see the cliffs in the background. And we were there.